New York City's finest saying thanks to those who've been working on the front lines this morning. NYPD officers showed up by the dozens to applaud and cheer out of state health care workers before their final shift. News 4's Erica Beifels in the newsroom with more on this emotional send off, Erica. It really was, David. These health care workers dropped everything in their own lines to rush, rush lives to rush here and help. An experience that many of them told us changed them forever. On a crisp morning in Midtown, the sound of clapping, cheers, and gratitude Woo! flooded the silence. Thank you. New York's finest saluting heroes, out of state health care workers who came to the city despite the risks. Friday marked the 21st day that they geared up to care for the ill in New York City's hospitals. Jason Alexander of Orlando has been working in hard hit Queens. It's been uh, quite scary at some of the things that we've seen. In my first time working, uh, walking into the emergency department, I was in absolute shock. The amount of patients, the overcrowding, um, it, it, patients were stacked on top of each other. The healthcare workers have been staying at the Park Central Hotel near Times Square. For many, it's been a challenge to be so far away from their families. Brooklyn Hazel of Columbus, Ohio, left her eight month old baby boy behind to treat the sick in the Bronx, an experience she called rewarding and taxing. It's more heartbreaking on the, the patient side because their families don't get to see their loved ones for the last time. So, like, I think that's what emotionally is really, really hard because you know that, like, you're there for them and you're the last people they see if they see you. She's leaving Friday. Like many of these health care workers, the rest aren't done. They signed up for yet another 21 day tour, like Jason. We just feel like um, uh, our job is not done here and our uh, heart still belongs here. <laughs> Heading out Wednesday, knowing New Yorkers thank them for their sacrifice. Several of the health care workers told us that the citywide clapping and cheering at 7 o'clock each night is a reminder of why they're here and ultimately just makes them feel appreciated. David? And we want to make sure they do feel that. Erica Byfield in our newsroom, thank you.